Hi guys, Dominic here, and we have the two girls uh, attaching a band, quite a light band to a kettlebell. That could also be a dumbbell. You could use a post as well. And we are doing a core front raise with bands. And the purpose of the exercise is to obviously really work on your midline stability. So in that position, they're pulling the shoulders down and back. They're tilting the pelvis backwards, staying super tight, being very, very careful not to lean backwards in this exercise and really use their abs as much as they can. They're moving the arms around a little bit to challenge themselves. So definitely, definitely not doing that and leaning backwards, staying super tight. They could lift one hand a little bit higher than the other. They could do pulses up and down like they're doing right now as they've mastered that then they would go and do a, a lunge backwards which you'll do in a second so again the main benefit of this exercise is for people who might find kicking their core in quite hard um, and it's good to do exercises such as uh, this that'll force them to kind of get into a better position with the pelvis kind of rotating backwards and having to stimulate their core whereas if you give them the opportunity to not turn it on such as a plank or a hollow hold they can kind of maybe feel it in the wrong areas um, as they get better at the lunge, they can put in a bit more resistance, move the hands down the band a little bit more, or use a heavier band, but all the time they're keeping the hands up to force them to use their core an awful lot more. Um, they could use a plate in this exercise as well, but I found in, in order to just really fire the core, I find this a better option for people. So give it a go. Um, I would give them themselves about maybe 20 or 30 seconds um, in each set.